A midnight deadline passed with no deal. That means Minnesota state government has shut down for the second time in six years. Political leaders couldn't agree on how to solve a $5 billion budget deficit. Talks between Democratic Governor Mark Dayton and top Republicans fell apart well before the deadline. Dayton demanded tax increases on top earners, but the GOP refused. Unfortunately, despite many hours of intense negotiations, the Republican Legislative Caucus has remained adamantly opposed to any additional tax revenue. This is about shutting down government for a political purpose. Very disappointing, very disheartening. The state padlocked parks and rest areas ahead of the busy July 4th weekend. The full impact is being felt Friday with thousands of state employees being laid off and a wide array of services suspended. Critical functions like state troopers, prison guards, courts and disaster response will continue. John Belmont, Associated Press.